I wanted to have something, something here on the hill that would let our neighbors and friends and those driving by and those out walking their dogs have a feeling of hope. It's something those neighbors and friends have been able to count on since the Wyndham Hill Church of Christ suspended services back in mid-March. A daily concert featuring chimes, which ring out from the speakers inside the church steeple. Music is my life, really. Cora Moody has worshipped and played the organ at this church since the 1960s. She's one of three organists who volunteer either two or three days a week to play. It's something really nice with the way things are today to come up here and be able to do this. It's a reassurance kind of a thing. Everybody wants to do something to help. And it's not a big deal. It's something small, but it's, you feel like you're not quite so helpless. All three women jumped at the invitation to play these daily concerts on the church's carolin, a separate instrument from the organ with a single smaller keyboard. This is really fun to play because you don't have to be super musical. All you have to do is one hand. You don't have to coordinate two hands at all. And their music runs the gamut from the traditional hymns, children's music, patriotic songs, We want to speak to everyone. We don't have any restrictions as to what sort of music is appropriate for us. No matter what the tune, however, when the chimes ring, church pastor Sally Colgrove is always out front, waving at the people as they drive or walk by. And more often than not, the folks wave back. I'd like them to feel connected. I'd like them to see a face as well as just hearing the bells. Ringing up a message of hope with a simple 30 minutes of music. It can lift you up and it can calm you down and, uh, and give you that peace. It's uh, music's magic. We could all use those messages of hope right about now. There is one concert each day. The times vary, they tell us, between 10 in the morning and 6 in the evening.